Here comes the awe-inspiring, high-flying Hall of Famer. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Battle Creek, Michigan, weighing in at 235 pounds, Rob Van Dam. A man who lives his life way up high. From the underground to superstardom, Rob Van Dam is truly the whole damn show. The internet was right. It's Super Cena. Oh, we are so lucky to be seeing him. Well, kind of. And his opponent from West Newberry, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, John Cena. Guys, is my monitor broken? I don't see anything. Only the worthy can see him, Saxton. Byron, you strike me as the kind of kid who thought about what ratings to give his creator wrestler. I'm like Cena here. Just move every stat to 100. Yeah, but the difference here is that Cena has earned it. He's evolved from an all-time great to practically invincible. We've seen John Cena play a superhero in Hollywood, but now he's one in reality. The bell rings, and John Cena is looking like he's got that big fight feel coursing through his veins right now. I think John Cena approaches every match with that same big fight mentality, Michael. There are few superstars who will push themselves to the limits that John Cena does in every match. I agree. I don't think Cena will be pulling any punches here tonight. And he'll be facing off against Rob Van Dam. Hopefully he's done his homework and can hang step for step with RVD. You know, I don't think any amount of homework can prepare you for RVD. You've really got to expect the unexpected to always be on your toes. Even with that, you'll only have a slim advantage. And don't adjust your TVs. The meme has come true. You can't see John Cena. Well, I thought I was just being blinded by the glare off of Saxton's bald head, but seeing, in this case, not seeing, is believing. We'll follow those jean shorts and sweatbands as best we can, but this is unprecedented, guys. How can you hit what you can't see? Don't do it! 
Suicide dive! Just exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. Cross landing powerbomb! Corey, is there a key victory for Cena going up against Rob Van Dam? Cena's power is not of this world. If Jonathan utilized that strength to immobilize one of RVD's legs, that'll take away Van Dam's martial arts kicks and his ability to attack by air. Suplex! He reverses it! Picked up. He's adamant about this sit-out powerbomb! Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Van Dam is out of the way. Right across the back of the neck. And it hits to the... Oh, a bear hug squeezing the breath out of him. It's not embarrassing to tap out. He'll save your career. But his will to win is simply too strong. There will be no... Oh, the bear hug. And a way to get out of it is being on display right here. Can Van Dam show? And how much more power does Cena have left in it? It's moments like this that define your legacy. Gets him in position. This is not going. Where, where's Cena gonna go here? What's he gonna do? I don't know. Oh my god. Cena! No way. Second rope! And that can keep RBD down. Left in him with that kick out. It is the invisibility clip. on point. Not done yet. We got part two on the way. To the judgment. Cena connected there. Two. Here is your winner. Resilience. John Cena demonstrated all of it and more to score the win over Rob Van Dam. No doubt about it. Cena earned that W. What a battle.